The Legos won six varsity football games the last three years combined. But Ralph Munger is now the Lions head coach. We have to remember Rockford has 28 consecutive winning seasons. The first 25 of those were under his direction. As we get set to go in 2023, Brett Bikita, I'm sure Coach Munger has no intentions of losing. So it's time for New Ego to turn around. No, and you know what? You can see the excitement on his face, the smile. He's ready to go. Every time he comes into a community, Frank can move to start, then Rockford, now New Ego. I mean, he just brings an excitement level, right? He's a Hall of Fame coach. Restore the roar is the motto. And all through the kids that we talk to, and you can even feel it in the community, they're excited for this team and what they can do. There's no question that the players are excited right now. There's an excitement in the program, and they even say it's maybe not as tough as some may think he is. A lot of the coaches say that he used to be really hard back, but he's really more relaxed with us. Um, I mean, it's a surprise me. Surprise me, he came here. <laughs> he's most wanted coach in Michigan. I feel like we're going to do really good this year because coach has been doing real good with us. He's been teaching us a lot, and I feel like this year is just different. It's all about mind. You just got to think about it. You just got to know that you're going to win. And if you know you're going to win, then you're probably going to. This Coach Munger, he knows what he's talking about. He knows the game plans. He knows what to do. And I don't know, I have confidence in this team. Kids have been really good. They've been great. And I think as time goes on, uh, you know, we can grow this program. Uh, hopefully we can make it extremely competitive. Uh, and, and, you know, hopefully we can help the young men um, establish life, uh, life lasting uh, characteristics, you know, that will help them in their futures. Life, life, life. And getting to know these guys, uh, they're competitive. Um, so we're hoping that the way that our system operates, you know, that it will be met with favor, not only with our young men, but on the scoreboard as well. So numbers are always a big issue, right? I mean, there were 12 juniors and 10 seniors on the varsity team last year. Coach says he's got 34 guys out for varsity football right now, and he thinks he's got a pretty good squad. Yeah, he's got some pretty good skilled players. He's got some players that are raw that maybe are playing for the first time that we talked to and excited for what they can do. But it's not going to be easy because the CSAA gold is tough. I mean, Big Rapids, Reed City was a semifinalist in Division Six. They open with Kent City, another playoff team. Three of their first four games are against playoff teams, but Ralph Munger loves that challenge. Yeah, well, the Central State's gold. It's a good league. There's good teams there. Tri-County was a co-champion of the league a year ago. We'll be checking with them tonight on Fox 17 News at 10. But for now, we're going to send it back to the studio.